On Friday, a judge struck down an executive order in a New York county that prohibited so-called transgender athletes from competing in women's sports. To recap, Town Hall previously reported how Nassau County, New York banned girls sports leagues that permit so-called transgender athletes to compete against females. The move was done through an executive order signed by County Executive Bruce Blakeman. Shortly after, New York Attorney General Letitia James, D., sent a cease and desist letter to the county over the order. In response to the cease and desist letter, Blakeman announced that the county would sue James. According to Fox News, Judge Francis Risigliano ruled that Blakeman did not have the authority to issue the order banning transgenders from women's sports, via Fox News. In his 13-page decision, Risigliano, wrote that Blakeman's order was aimed at preventing transgender women from participating in girls and women's athletics in county parks, despite there being no corresponding legislative enactment providing him with such authority. In doing so, this court finds the county executive acted beyond the scope of his authority as the chief executive officer of Nassau County, Risigliano wrote. In a statement to the Associated Press, Blakeman wrote, lack of courage from a judge who didn't want to decide the case on its merits. Unfortunately, girls and women are hurt by the court. When Blakeman signed the order in February, he told the New York Post, we are protecting girls' right to compete against other girls. It makes no sense for biological boys who identify as transgender to compete against girls. It's completely unfair. Biological boys are faster, bigger and stronger. They have a physical advantage against women. In March, Manhattan's largest neighborhood school board district approved a resolution that could lead to a ban on so-called transgender athletes in girls' sports, which Town Hall also covered.